Call her. Okay. Hey. You haven't left yet. No, I'm boarding now. What's up? Um, would you mind doing it again? Last time. Oh. Sweet. The Chevy Cruze with the My Chevrolet app. The remote control car is finally here. Why not? She's just playing with us. This one did not disappoint. Myrtle Beach and Conway playing for that, the victory bell. It's been at Doug Shaw Stadium for the past four years. But Conway came thinking about turning the tie. And on the opening kickoff, well, what do we have here? Bernie Johnson with the strip right there. The Tigers fall on it, and Conway is in business on a six-yard line. What a way to start the game. The Tigers jump on all the momentum. Here's Michael Moody. Looks like he's sacked. Uh-uh, the pass to Cole Watson. Five yards for the score, seven-nothing Tigers in front. Myrtle Beach would face some adversity throughout this game. Jaquan Wilson, injured, did not return. That's a key playmaker. Then, some trickery. Sawyer Jordan in at quarterback, but Moody on the end around reverse couldn't hang on to it. The Seahawks fall on it. But the Conway special teams unit was huge tonight. There, a blocked field goal. Max Huggins can't put points on the board, but Myrtle Beach would get it back. And this is Tyler Keene to Trell Harrell. Harrell with a huge game. Knocked out of bounds by Malcolm Green. But the Seahawks switching sides, same drive, second quarter, fourth and goal. Vincent Hoover looking for six. Ain't happening. Big stop by the Conway defense. So the Tigers take over deep in their own territory, but no problem. It's Mike Cal Moody time. Oh my. 92 yards for Mike Cal Moody. And it is a 14-0 Conway lead. What a huge run. Maybe the biggest touchdown run of the year in 2011 as far as the Zone Nation goes. Myrtle Beach. Tyler Keene to Tyrone Cooper. What a great grab. You can see these two teams were throwing haymakers and they kept coming back. Then Keene on third and 29. Nice job of scrambling. Dequarius Wilson's got it for the first down. He stepped out of bounds right there. The drive stays alive. And Myrtle Beach would get on the scoreboard before the halftime. C.J. Cooper, Vincent Hoover, perfect. It's a 14-6 Conway lead at the half. But in the third quarter, Moody was at it again. This, 65 yards. And this is why Michael Moody has to be in the Zoman conversation. He played big time in a big time game. 21-6 Tigers. And now Myrtle Beach in scramble mode, not used to playing from behind. C.J. Cooper to Tremond Wilson. Wilson goes 71 yards. And the Seahawks are marching. Cooper rolling right. Throws left. And what a catch by Trell Harrell. 23 yards, makes it a 21-12 game. But the Conway defense would allow no more. Here, Cooper under pressure and goes down. And the victory bell is heading back to the Conway Tigers. Tremendous football game tonight between the Tigers and the Seahawks. Wow, 21 to 12 is your final. Myrtle Beach fans, do not worry at all. The Seahawks playing a rugged schedule and now get ready for region play next week against Wilson. Moody left the game with a slight concussion. He'll be ready two weeks from now when Conway begins region play. We talked with Chuck Jordan about getting the bell back. Well, you know, we've had it for most of the last 28 years, so we got it back, and we're happy to have it back in Conway where it belongs. Well, it's always fun to beat Myrtle Beach, and it, it's a big win. You know, they were playing with a lot of confidence, and, uh, you know, the biggest thing is that, that, you know, they're well coached. They got great kids, and we just uh, outplayed them tonight.